to get started with separating our name into separate layers, I first created my name in a pretty heavy font and have scaled it up to a large size and I have it exactly the way I want. Once I go through this process of breaking my name apart and distributing it to layers, I will no longer be able to go back and edit my type with the type tool over here. It'll be as if I have drawn it with the pen tool. So I'm going to select my entire name, go up to the modify menu, and choose break apart. That will divide each of the letters of my name into separate uh, items. Go back to the same command, go back to modify, and say break apart again. That will then turn my letters into drawings. You can see the mesh is on them. As they remain selected, and clicking nowhere else, go back one more time to modify, go to timeline, and choose distribute to layers. You'll then see all of the layers appear, including one blank one. We can hide each of these layers to identify which is which. By unhiding, I can see. So there's that first layer that I do not need that can be deleted. My letter A. So I'm going to double click on layer two and type the letter A. So now I know which letter is in that layer. That is my capital N. Now that you have your letters each distributed to different layers and the layers are renamed, you're ready to, to begin animating. I might start with my in layer and sometimes you can simply hide the other layers so that it can help you focus. It's already where I want it to appear, so I'm going to go out to frame 20 and insert a keyframe and then come back to my first frame and move my in off the screen. And finally, to create the in-between frames, I will right click, right -click in between those two keyframes, choose Create Classic Tween, and click on OK to convert that into a symbol. Following that pattern, I can continue to animate each of my own letters, realizing that because they only have a keyframe in frame one, they're going to disappear. If I can go on and add frames, they would appear as they go along. Good luck and have fun.